Greetings and salutations. I'm back down the shed with my ever so humble co-host, the Pool Pump. I am come down here to start working on my arms. Now, the idea at the moment is I need to attach these onto the side of this body I've built, but these require a bit of modification. Now, this is just some ducting joiners. I've been in slightly inspired by Punish Prop's uh, recent painting booth build. That being said, I've always considered this a possibility for doing these arms this way. I, as I said in the other video, the logistics video, I did want to have something a bit more solid, something that reflected the original source material, but as things go, I just need to get this done. So what I need to do specifically is I need to take two of these rings and I'm gonna cut out one side of these because these are gonna go on the inside of the body out. I don't need this extra part protruding in where it's gonna make a bit more difficult to get it here. I'm also gonna grind out all this extra stuff. Now, I'm not sure if you can see, these aren't perfectly aligned anyway, so they're no use to me. So I'm gonna you know, probably dremel or grind them out. I'm probably just gonna dremel these out. Probably use a hacksaw on these. I was just gonna dremel these off, but I think taking it slow and getting these, using that edge as a guide is gonna really help. The other thing is I gotta go into the body and place these down roughly where I want them so I can draw out the the circle of a sharpie and I can start cutting these out. I'm probably not gonna show you how to, I'm gonna do that because that body is really big and clumsy and it's hard to get onto and still have the camera on the table. So let's start cutting these down to size. What are, the other thing I need to do, so the other thing I need to do as well is figure out how I'm gonna attach these. Now I've got this plate on here for when I was gonna do the hard um, body. Actually, the reason I got these as big as I did is because I had to make sure that that handle was gonna fit. So these are 150 millimeter joiners, and that's 150, oh, that's 200. I think I got the wrong one. Oh, don't tell totally me I got the wrong one. I got the wrong one. Oh, that's all right, I'll, I'll, I'll just take that back. I have gotta take that back. Excellent, I grabbed the wrong one. I need 150, I grabbed the wrong one. Good, wunderbar. I'll just take that back It's and just swap it out. Brilliant. Wonderful. I might just bite the bullets and make a covering that goes over this and you know it's just got to split and I'll just put it around. But the good thing is then that just gives me something extra solid to glue onto there. The alternative is I cut out a ring and then cut out a square and and it's probably gonna be way much more hassle than it's worth. So I've got to figure so I've got to figure out how I'm gonna plate this up. I'm probably gonna have to reinforce it in all sorts so as you can see I can't put it that way it has to come on that way and there's it already kind of just sits in there as is, so it might just be that thing where I just make a thing to go on top of it. We'll see. So let's get cracking.
So as you can see, I've uh, got these all on now. So I'm probably gonna do some puttying and maybe some extra gluing on these just to get them all down. Although, I'm, to be honest, I don't think people are gonna really notice too much. But, you know, a bit of due diligence wouldn't hurt. As I said, I've still got to putty and round all this up. I'm still deciding on how I want to... I still have a load of LEDs which I can put in. So maybe just add some you know, LEDs along here, just to kind of you know, break up that flat plane. Maybe I could probably add some, maybe some foam strips, kind of give the illusion of a finger, make it look like whoever was building these claws went, uh, well, they're kind of non-functional, not really that good. Let's stick a couple of things on there to make them look like fingers so people won't notice it until they go back from the shop. And now I just need to cut out where the rings go on the body see I've uh, cut the bottom bit off and I've smoothed these out a little bit these are gonna go pushing through the end so I need to essentially roughly like that it's just something so I can put attach the thing onto and even if I have to hold my hands like this yeah it's gonna happen I could maybe cut out a little bit of a lip on here and to give me a bit of flexibility so that's it for now. Hopefully I'll have a few more updates in the week, but I have got a ton of building to do and I want to see how I'm going to get it all done first. So until next time, please like, share, subscribe, click the bell down below if you want notifications. Please leave comments if you liked what I do, if you want to see more of some of the same, if you've got any hints, tips and techniques you think I should try, by all means share and enjoy. See ya.